What we do at the lab is we have the first and the largest esports science research lab in Europe and in some respects the world. We study everything from the psychology, the cognition, the movement of gamers and non-gamers, basically trying to understand all aspects of gaming health and performance. Some cognitive abilities or some cognitive tests, men are shown to be better than, than women, but there are a number of cognitive tests where women are shown to be better than men. Um, but we're gonna put these little sensors. So the sensor is gonna go on your hand, your arm and your forearm. And then the sensor basically picks up all of the motion. So 3D motion of your hand, arm and forearm. So while you're doing the task, we can look at basically all of your biomechanical movement strategies as you're doing that task and compare elites to sub-elites to men, women, and look at even strategies for how you move to do the same sort of task. To be a lab rat is actually pretty fun. You get to try things and you get to learn things about yourself as well. I'm getting yeah. super yeah. confused. Yep, yeah, they can use me. <laughs> So we've been partnering with Logitech for the last eight, nine years. Logitech are really interested in understanding the science behind health and performance in gamers so that they can dial in their equipment that they supply teams and gamers with in such a way that it's actually going to help gamers with their health and performance. With the sensors, I felt like we are doing some important things there. After the test, I realized my uh, left side flex was not that good, actually. I think it's really interesting. I'm really excited also to see my scores, like how it did compared to like other people. I think uh, it's great because there's not been like a lot of research about uh, women in gaming. So I think it's a really great first step and I'm happy to be part of it. Through some of the work that we've done in our lab, we've been able to identify what the optimal training schedule might look like for a gamer so that they can not burn out, but also then obviously perform at a, at a really high consistent level. They've been really performing at a high level. I mean, we still have to dive into, uh, dive into the data once we get it back to the lab, but um, anecdotally, um, really impressive to, to see some of the performance on, on the tests uh, today.